Hey, so I'm very excited. Have a look what happened yesterday evening. What's that? Can you hear that? There's noise going on around the back of the van and it's not me. What could be happening? This is exciting, exciting stuff. Look at this. There's a busy young man, look. A busy young man at the back of my van. <laughs> Hard at work, look at these lads. Let me show you what they've been doing here. Oh, you've been eating your tea, you missed that bit. Yeah. I was chewing on a lasagna with the kids while these lads were hard at work out here. <laughs> so yeah, these holes that you remember. Nicely welded up. Uh, and they're going to be covered obviously by the floor eventually. So now they are having a quick look at where them uh, little vents were in the ceiling. I don't need much because once I've got because in, it'll burn that, paint off that one up there was going to be in the way of my Max Air fan. He's working. <laughs> got a Max Air fan coming uh, in the next few days. Uh, I'm not sure if we're fitting that in this video, possibly the next one. But it was uh, in the way, that, that vent was really big on the top, so it would have been in the way of it. So it has to go. And yeah, get him to seal up the, get him to weld up the hole. Stop for a quick look then at what's going on. So as you can see, they've welded the plate on underneath. And what we're gonna do is pop some filler across the top of here to make it smooth. But it doesn't matter so much, this is gonna be covered. I'm gonna be cutting right through the middle of here because I'm gonna be putting a skylight on here. But the other one over there will be visible. So um, what they're gonna do is just clean it up on top get some filler in it and it'll be smooth flat and we'll paint it up and it'll be perfect then there's going to be a little max air fan going next to it like i say that could be in the next video all right john's in his pajamas but i want him to come and have a look <laughs> wow no so they've sprayed some zinc on it which protects it a bit like the red well better than the red oxide that we pay, painted on There we go. And then these, John, look. Now this is very difficult to do because the metal is so thin that he's just had to spot weld lots of little times. He couldn't do a continuous weld around. And then they're going to put some sealant and filler on the top tomorrow. Cool. Good, huh? Yeah, very cool. Awesome. So what does that mean, Mr. John? We can do the floor. Yeah, you got it. We can do the floor. We haven't got our microphones on. The public can't hear him. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. I'm Adrian, single father to 13-year-old twins, John and Ella. Hi. Our journey began in Thailand, where I used to work as an underwater cameraman, and that's where I met their mom. Tragically, we lost her during the birth in Bangkok. I later moved back to the UK to be closer to family. Now, nine years later, I'm home educating the kids and planning exciting adventures. I've always known the transformative power of travel, and I want my children to experience it while they're still young enough to want to go with their old dad. We converted my trusty work van into a cozy camper van to embark on incredible journeys. Our future plan is to upgrade to a bigger van and make a more permanent home in Europe. Join us on our journey as we explore the world, learn and grow together. So that's good news. And now, obviously, I would like very, very much to be laying the floor. We also have a Max Air fan coming for the roof, for those who don't know, that's your ventilation fan. We've also got uh, a Max Air skylight coming for the rear, it's gonna go over the beds. And we've got a window coming for the slidey door. It's all happening. It's getting exciting. Well, as usual, time is my enemy and I am not working on the van, as you might see. 
I've taken a week and a half away from work in order to work on the van, but so far haven't managed to get anything done because I couldn't work on anything until the welders had been. That's now done. They're coming back tonight to just do a little bit of filling and protection coat on it, so I can't really do anything today. As it happens, I've got to go through to a rental property I own with a business partner and look at a valuation on that, so I'm busy doing that. Um, when I get home, it's going to be too late in the day really to get anything done once again. Time. Time, time, time. I just don't have it. If you remember the start from the last week's video, everyone really liked that and commented on it. Um, I don't even have time to make such a nice intro like I did last week. It's just me talking in a van. So, onto the property, get a valuation. I might give you a quick look at this property actually. Right, I know you're not here to see this. You want to look at van conversions and stuff and what me and my family get up to. That's what we're all here for, isn't it? But I just thought you might be interested in having a quick little look at this. So this is a property which I renovated a few years ago to rent out. Now, what I might do, first of all, I'll have a little look here, go through into this room. There we go. Now what I might do at this point is show you a photo of what it looked like. Sort of before, during and after. Yeah, so, as you can see, there's quite a bit of change happened. <laughs> Let's give you a little look over here. It was well over a year of my life, almost two years of my life renovating this place. Show you the kitchen. And again, I'm gonna hold the camera there and I'm gonna show you a before shot. A before, during, and uh, after shot, there you go. And then down here, the same with the bathroom. I've got a noisy extractor fan. So there you go. Obviously it's lived in. It's lived in with some tenants at the moment. Uh, it's a HMO, it rents out by the room. So there's a couple of people upstairs, someone's on holiday and one of the rooms is empty. So I can very quickly show you that room. Here we go. So this is the smallest room in the property. And it is up for rent at the moment. So there you go. I know that's got nothing to do with vans or anything, but uh, I just thought some of you followers who've been following us for a very, very long time just might be interested. So what was that I was saying about time on the way through to the house there? Hmm? Yes, well, <laughs> as it turns out, it looks like I'm gonna go and fit a bathroom sink this afternoon. Wasn't on the cards originally, but a customer got in touch with me and it, uh, it was a sink that hadn't been delivered because of a supply issue from a job from a while ago and it's now there and it could do with been done this next week really and I thought I would rather get it done today than have it interfere with the van project next week so yeah I'm gonna go and do it now well after lunch and I thought why not show you around because this is another project which was a full renovation not the same as the one back there that was mine and my business partner's project it's very high high spec high standard and we rent it out um, so yeah it's got to look beautiful this one is more of a done up to sell project so as you'll see it's very just white walls white skirts basic carpet throughout it's still very nice and again we'll see if we can do you some before and after shots it's uh, it's a very nice house it's come together beautifully but like I say, it's more of a blank canvas. So it goes on the market, whoever buys it can then do the walls the colors they want and make changes to things as they want. So there's no point doing color when you're selling it really. So that's the next stop after some lunch. Okay, so just bear with me. This video is a bit all over the place and I realize it's not about vans, but it's actually suddenly become a little bit about property, hasn't it? <laughs> Which is something I used to be heavily involved with. And obviously I do renovations for people, kitchens and bathrooms mostly, but I do full houses as well. Um, so let's have a look at this one. I haven't been here for months. Last I saw, we'd finished everything and there was no carpets down. So let's have a look. 
All right, ah, there's my sink that I need to fit in the bathroom. So this was a kitchen. Half of this kitchen was already in. I removed it in order for the plasterers to plaster the walls properly. And we added this section because there used to be a brick wall and an old cupboard thing there. We got rid of all that. I put this nice floor down and then it's been carpeted. Oh, wow. That's nice to see. Pop through in here. This is a lovely room. Gets a lot of sunlight, this room. So like, like I said, as you can see, it's all very white and a very standard carpet, but it's for sale or it will be for sale. So therefore they can choose whatever colors they want. But what I should do is like I did at our property, I should get you a shot like this and then do a bit of a before and after. And there's not much else to see there all the rest of them are just rooms there we go it's a room and then there's this little funny hallway sort of room and then this is a massive room at the back here so again I'll try and drop in a photo or a bit of video that I had from before and It's all new doors, it's all new doors. This is a, obviously a brand new bathroom. Teeny weeny little shower room here. And then, what I've got to work on today is in here. bathroom matches but as you can see it's missing the wash basin there's the taps they've been sat there for months <laughs> um, yeah this one's got a bath in it a nice rain shower so I'm gonna be getting that done so there you go I hope that was of some interest at this point in the video, I have no idea how long it will be until I edit it. I don't know if I'm going to trim this down to a little two minute section about property and then get on with van conversion stuff, or if I might make this video predominantly about these properties. Why not? It's of some interest to you, surely. Um, so yeah, I not only renovate vans, I can renovate properties as well. But it is now, I know I said this last week as well, it's now Friday afternoon and because I'm going to do this, I'm not going to get any work done on the van today. So Saturday is going to be a big day on the van, which means there's no way, once again, I'm going to get a video edited and ready for Saturday night. So I might make hay while the sun shines. We might work on the van on Sunday, on Monday, on Tuesday, because the weather's looking good. So this video could actually be a whole week later than planned, but I'll put a post on YouTube so you'll have known, but it's probably pointless to tell you this because you're watching this video and you're going, yeah, we know it's a week late because it's a week later. Yeah, haven't thought this through, have I? <laughs> right, anyway, I'm going to install this sink. Next time, I promise, next time I see you, we'll be looking at working on the van. Oh, and I've just been home for my lunch and there's some packages arrived. I'll show you later. Yes, we're back at the van. But I owe you an apology because we are not going to be doing any work on the van in this video now. There's no time, simply no time. And I came to the decision, I thought, well, it's either no video this week uh, and you get van conversion stuff next week, or I release this little video about the property renovations that I've been doing and have done in the past. And you've got something for this week, which I thought was better than nothing. But anyway, in the meantime, I promised you a look at the packages. Let's quickly have a look at those. So in here, when I got back yesterday lunchtime, there was this humongous thing. That is a window for the slidey door on the side of the van. Here, we have got my first ever Max Air fan. 
first one I've ever owned. I always seen them on YouTube, other people fitting them. I'm like, oh, that looks so nice, but never thought I'd own one. Then here by the same company, Max Air, this is, what do they call it? Sky Air or something? Can't remember. That is a huge, I'm not going to unpack it because you get to see that next week. That is a huge uh, skylight for the back. It's going to go over the beds. And then also this, not an advertisement. I wish it was, <laughs> then I'd make money. This is Blit Hammer, uh, this product here. This was recommended by James. James, who was here doing the welding over the last few days. He restores old cars for a living. He's well known for it. Ford Escorts, actually, that's his main bag. Um, he has people from all over the world coming for his escorts. Anyway, he knows what he's doing. And he recommended this stuff over a basic wax oil. He says it's just far better. Um, when the temperature increases, it goes soft again ever so slightly, and it just oozes further and further into the gaps and nooks and crannies. And anyway, just better than a standard wax oil. And it wasn't even overpriced, it was quite cheap. I think that was about 16, 17 pounds for one spray can. Uh, you can buy it in bigger tubs as well. But anyway, like I say, it's not an advertisement video. So I'm gonna get back out in the sun. It's lovely today. So one more time, apologies, it's not a van conversion video. This one, it was something a bit different this week. But thank you all the same for watching. Anyway, I really, really appreciate it. And uh, the channel's doing really, really well. We're officially monetized now. Should start to see money coming in. Yay! <laughs> Um, so all it means is for you guys, just like and subscribe, please, that's free. But do hop across to our Patreon if you want. It's down in the links below and you can buy us a coffee, one-time donation. It's all a massive, massive help. For those of you who don't know, when this is ready, we're leaving this house. We're heading out into Europe full time. We are not, I'm not gonna be working anymore. We're gonna be making a living solely from these videos and from social media and from Patreon. And, coffee links and donations and <laughs> I'm going to be working on affiliate marketing as well but this is the only way we're going to make a living so if you're happy to help us if you want to keep watching these videos you want to see it go further then please 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 hit those links below come and have a look at patreon otherwise it's free to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next week for van stuff I promise van stuff van stuff